We are covering PL300 Microsoft Power BI Data Analyst. Our team is working hard to keep the content up to date. If you find this video helpful, please let us know in the comments. We really appreciate if you like and subscribe to our channel. To get the complete list of questions and answers, click on the playlist link provided in the description. Our question is, you are creating a line chart in the Power BI report as shown in the following exhibit. See the given exhibit. Use the drop down menus to select the answer choice that completes each statement based on the information presented in the graphics. The dashed line representing a year average employee count was created by using dash. A trend line, a secondary axis, an average reference line, two measures in the values bucket. To enable users to drill down the weeks or days, add the weeks and days field to the dash bucket. Access, values, legend, secondary values. This is the correct answer. The ones highlighted with green color. Next, you have the dashboard that contains styles pinned from the single report as shown in the original dashboard exhibit. See this one? You need to modify the dashboard to appear as shown in the modified dashboard exhibit. What should you do? Change the report theme. Option B, change the dashboard theme. Option C, edit the details of each tile. Option D, create a custom CSS file. The correct answer is option B. Next. You have the Power BI report. The report contains a visual that shows gross sales by date. The visual has anomaly detection enabled. You need to increase the likelihood that anomaly detection will identify anomalies in the report. What should you do? Option A, increase the expected range transparency settings. Option B, add the data field to the legend field well. Option C, increase the sensitivity settings. Option D, add the data field to the secondary values field well. Correct answer is option C. Next, you maintain a Power BI workspace that contains a supplier quality dashboard. The dashboard contains 10 visual cards, 2 map visual and 5 bar chart visual. The dashboard mobile layout is shown in the exhibit. See this one?
You need to modify the dashboard mobile layout to meet the following requirements. Only show single value visuals. Minimize scrolling. What should you do? Option A, decrease the size of card visual, remove the map and bar chart visuals. Option B, decrease the size of map and bar chart visual. Move all the card visual to the top of the layout. Option C, remove the card visual, increase the size of map and bar chart visual. Option D, move the bar chart visual of the top layout, remove the map visual, decrease the size of card visuals. Correct answer is option A.